First combination of down at the start there, uh, about to be released from the start box. We're inside one minute before the first combination on course, and it is for Italy. Matteo Orlandi and Camelot to Dan Gurt. Christian Sentman Sweden designed this uh, cross country course is uh, Matteo Orlandi, the first team member from Italy. They start on a dressage score 54.8. Lying in 32nd place after the dressage is lovely uh, Salian, 11 years old by Beaujolais. They're of the brush at three. Coming down to the first of the combination fences at four. I know a lot of the teams have got spotters out there to see how the first few riders, but the trailblazer jumps the white ox and beautifully through the first of the combination fences. That's how it should be done. Very confident start. Optimum time, 6 minutes 49 seconds. Matteo Orlandi, a lovely big jump at the picnic table. Now comes to the Log Oxer. It's a big fence. Really going well. The first of the Italian team. You all see a good stride. And uh, Camelot Damgord answers the questions. Now turns away from the control box, downhill to the log. So the downhill log then sets them up, they get their feet wet for the first time. Steep climb up the hill to the horse's head and then the brush box. We'll see what the trailblazer makes of this. They're coming back into view through the trees. Matteo Orlandi and the 11-year-old Salian, Camelot Jamgurt, taking the direct line. Wow, just uh, gets a little bit close to the second part, but gets away with it. Kicks on the way to the right-handed corner at 15. Looking in a very good rhythm. Matthew Orlandi comes a downhill. Left hand turns the right-handed corner. What a lovely confident jump and kicks on away. This is a great start for Italy. I can't hear much cheering from the Italians. Well, taking the right hand option at 16, the rails. Camelot Damgurt goes to the wheelbarrow now, comes back into view. I think most will take the left hand option here. As our second away on course, the first team member for the Netherlands, it is Oka Piemann and Hip Hop. They start in 40th place on 56 dressage. They're clear of the first two, going to the, the third, the brush at three now. Quite closely related, fence two and three, but a good start. Hey, As Matthew Orlandi. As a Matthew Orlandi. Camelot Damgurd comes to the water. Big jump in, now the upturn boat. Great to jump there. Oka Piemann with the nine-year-old gelding. Hip hop at fence four, takes the turn. Right. Great to jump there. Oka Piemann with the nine-year-old gelding. Hip hop at fence four, takes the turn. Right-handed. Well, 
Star Trailblazer making this course designed by Lars Christensen look very easy indeed so far. Now here. Making his way round to the oh, bank complex here. 20 A, B and C. Not now. Wait, I say. Oka Beeman, hip hop. To the first of the combination oh, fences at four. They've jumped through there and then taken the slightly wider route at the sawmill. Mathieu Orlandi absolutely flying across the country, beautifully on and off the bank. Just chipping in an extra stride. On and off the bank. Just chipping in an extra stride. At the fallen tree at seven is the Dutch rider Oka Piemann and Hip Hop. Lovely jump at the picnic table and is rounding the turn back towards home. First out on the course and the first team member for Italy, Mathieu Orlandi, Camelot Damgord. Back to the water for the final time. It's the fish in the water and the triple arrowhead brush that sets them up for their run home. Fence 22A, 22 a 22 that sets them up for their run home. Fence 22A, 22B. Over the fish, over the arrowhead. The Italians are cheering him home. Two fences left. And he's absolutely flying. Mathieu Orlandi, coming up down good, comes to the penultimate fence. Over the roll top, and now the welcome sight of the Wilhelmsburg horseshoe. Over the last, great round there. We'll bring you his time just as soon as we can. With a clear round. In